Hello and welcome to the wonderful world of submitting. Uh, I'm going to try and teach you how to submit. This uh, is a area of difficulty for a number of the students um, first getting into Cisco and CCNA and uh, networking and things such as that. Um, first thing I'm going to do is show you a helpful little trick from time to time. You go to your start menu. Uh, under accessories, you'll have your calculator. Uh, under your calculator, uh, your calculator normally pop up looks like this. Just click on view, click on scientific. Uh, this will allow you to view binary numbers. Click on decimal, you get zero through nine. When you click on binary, only one and zero because that's the only numbers you use in binary, zero and one. Uh, hence the reason named binary, by bi meaning two. Okay, I just wanted to show that to you real quick. Um, let's go ahead and get started with the actual binary and subnetting portion. Um, you can use the calculator to go back and check, uh, make sure the answers are right. Okay, uh, binary as I said before is a two base counting system. Uh, it uses 0, 1, and that's pretty much it. Decimal is what uh, we use on a daily basis, what the masses use for. Pretty much all our calculations, uh, just about every culture in the world uses the decimal system, uh, uses numbers 0 through 9. Um, and then you have hexadecimal, which is used for things such as your MAC address, as well as uh, it'll be in IP version 6. Um, what will happen is uh, you got your 0 through 9, and once you get to 10, it reverts to the alphabet, so you use uh, A for 10. B for 11, C for 12, D for 13, E for 14, and F is your final at 15. So you have 16 numbers, uh, 16 representations, uh, 0 through F. Okay, um, this is your everyday decimal number, uh, 34,567. Uh, pretty much, the uh, way we're taught is uh, each one has a place value. Here you got uh, this is the ones place, uh, which is ten to the zero. Anything to the zero power will be one. Okay. Uh, next one is ten to the first power. Anything to the first power is itself. So ten to the first power is ten. Ten to the squared is a hundred. Ten cubed, a thousand. Ten to the fourth, ten thousand. Uh, then we just take the value for that place times whatever digit is uh, being held in that place. Okay, then we take and we multiply them out. Uh, 1 times 7, 7, 10 times 6, 60, 100 times 500, or 100 times 5 is 500, 1,000 times 4 is 4,000, 10,000 times 3 is 30,000. Uh, so you just take all of these numbers, add them up, 30,000, 4,000, 560, and 7, which we all know is 34,567. Uh, it's not much different in binary. Uh, only difference is instead of using 0 through 9, we only use ones and zeros. Uh, same principle though, since we're using two numbers, uh, we have 2 to the 0, where we were using 10 numbers before, so we had 10 to the 0, 10 to the first. Since we're using two numbers, we have 2 to the 0, which of course Anything to the zero, once again, is one. Two to the first, anything to the first is itself, so two to the first is two. Uh, two squared, four. Two cubed, eight. Two to the fourth, 16. Two to the fifth, 32. Two to the sixth, 64. And finally, two to the seventh, which is 128. Um, uh, easiest way to remember it is from right to left. You start with one on the right, uh, and each value doubles. So one times two is two, two times four, or 2 times 2 is 4, 4 times 2 is 8, 8 times 2 is 16, so forth, 32, 64, 128, each one of these values doubles. So if we have uh, a representation, representation of 1, 0, 1, 0, 1, 0, 1, 0, um, the first, of course, the value is 1, the value 2, 4, 8, 16, 32, 64, 128, just like this. Uh, just now I'm not including all the actual math, uh, it's just the actual value of that place.
Okay, so do the same thing. Uh, 128 times 1, 128. 64 times 0, 0. 32 times 1, 32. 16 times 0, 0. 8 times 1 is 8. 4 times 0, 0. 2 times 1, 2. 1 times 0, 0. Uh, okay, so we take and bring all these down and add these all up. So we got 128 plus 0, 32 plus 0, plus 8, plus 0, plus 2, plus 0. Uh, you can use your calculator add that all up. It is 170. Um, so that's binary. Uh, if you haven't still have problems with it, 